This is gonna be a disaster. It's gonna be funny. What, for who? For me? Well, no. <laughs> <laughs> Get away. Hello, Internet. So, there is something that many of you, my dear audience, have been asking me to do quite a lot since a certain rat called Phil did it over I'm on his channel. Listening. Fuck off, okay? Excuse me. <laughs> That's right. Can't watch this video on restricted mode now. JK, my whole channel is hidden. Which is understandable because I swear quite a lot. Online quizzes! We all know them, we all do them when we should be doing work. They can tell you everything from your sexuality to which gender-bended walking dead persona you are. So of course, you guys being such a creative and supportive audience, there are lots of quizzes out there on the internet themed around me. I didn't ask for this. Now you may think this would be funny like, how well do I know myself according to these quiz results, but what I'm genuinely terrified of right now is learning what you actually think of me. Because you see, there's the version of ourselves that the world actually sees and thinks of, and then there's the versions of ourselves that we fantasize about being in our heads. For me, that's like... Hello, Daniel here. Don't I look cool and mysterious and all this black I'm wearing, not just Depressing. Oh, what am I reading on my phone? Just a thesaurus that I use to extend my vocabulary. I know a lot of long words, and trust me, that's not all that's- Whoa, oh, let's pause that right there. But in reality, I know I'm more like- Why am I alive? So as well as this being a way for me to celebrate your support as a community of people watching my videos, this might be a, a, a rude awakening for what the world actually sees me like. All right, let's jump down the hole and break our legs. All right, so I think we should start with a pretty generic one about my whole life, so what percentage Dan Howell are you? How much Howell is there in your soul? See, already that's gotten off to a bad start because there can't be any Howell in your soul. I don't have one. Let's play. Oh, Jesus, I'm being attacked by Pepe straight off the bat. Right, how? <laughs> How do you like your memes? I was really worried that would be, how random are your llamas? So this could be worse. I feel like dank is the cool answer, but I'm always slightly outdated. So I'm gonna go for dank AF. Throwing a little bit of cringe there. Pry or craft? <laughs> oh, nice, nice reference there. Sorry about all the people that were scared after the Dan and Paul Crafts video. I'm gonna go with cry. Definitely more of a crier. Oh, okay. There we go, yeah, they, they did find a way to make me cringe a bit. Favorite kind of end screen dance, suggestive, alluring, sexy, the robot, or the cha-cha slide? Slide to the left. Well, the sexy end screen dance is dead. Uh, the robot is appealing, because I don't have any emotions like a robot. I'm, I'm gonna go with suggestive, which is what all of my humor is, accidentally. You were 100% Dan Howell, yes! I know myself. Back off, getting on my territory, what am I doing? In fact, aren't you just Dan? No one else could have scored so well unless they were the real thing. <laughs> Are they watching me through the webcam right now? Okay, I feel like that was, that was quite a good start. It wasn't too harrowing in any way. Let's go deeper. Can you guess the Dan Howell video from a single pixel? Are you fucking kidding me? No pressure, but if you don't get 100%, you're a fake fan. Is that blooper from pinoff 7, pinoff 4, or pinoff... Uh, uh, it's just, it's just a, like, I mean, that's quite a few pixels. I'm gonna go with pinoff 7. Wrong. It's technically the same, but how could you t Oh, whatever. Are they fucking serious? Number two, what Dan and Phil video is this one for? I'm, I'm gonna go with, uh, Dan reacts to his old videos. Obviously. You know, chat, it's, it's, it's that, that bed square right there. Whatever, uh, typos have ruined my, I don't care. Uh, this one, it's from Get Ready With Dan. Yep, the- oh, that happened. Cheeky nip. I got three. Well, that was shit. Are you fucking- is this Dan Howell or a hobbit? Can you tell the difference? Because we sure can't. Okay, okay, well, ha, quiz maker, cyberbullying me for my insecurity about my hair. Look what Danny's embraced now. Look, okay, for years you were like, Dan, Dan, you're the hobbit, you wear your hair curly, it's your good work. When I had my longer hair, when it got curly, there was no style. I just looked like a freaking bush. I looked like Frodo that had been kind of like hit with a hammer by an orc and his head caved in. That is a hobbit. Okay, there we go. Is is this uh, oh very funny? Okay, there we go. That that's uh, oh I I do actually look 
exactly the same as all of these freaking hot- this- that one does rank in top 10 most cringe selfies of my whole life. I'm, I'm glad to share that with several million people. Thank you for that. What, what a creative way to mock me. Okay, let's leave this website. Buzzfeed, yes. Time for some epic content. This is, is tagged under quiz and yas. Are you more like Dan or Phil? Let's bring in a Phil one here. Left or right? Well, I'm left-handed. Early bird or night owl? We're both night owls, so I, I don't know if this is like a trick question or something. I can assure you that neither of us wake up before midday. Oh, here we go. Lions or llamas? I love my branding. Socks or not? Phil wears a lot of socks, but they're odd. <laughs> like him, am I right? Still listening, you bitch. I'm gonna go with not, because I sometimes film videos not wearing any socks. I'm literally not wearing any pants right now. Are you ready for this? Oh, 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 the app, oh, that just graphically changed your opinion of this video, didn't it? Whoop. You got Dan, yes! That would be really weird if I got Phil. Oh god, no, they've described me, oh, this is my worst fear. You're more like Dan than Phil, you like browsing the internet for hours. In a certain position, many hours into the night, you approach anything with sarcasm and sardonic humour. Good use of sardonic. You may have had an obsession with placenta when you- Don't, don't, no, no, ah! Oh. You don't really like people, and you could probably do without going outside ever, except for your need of food. Ah, oh, I, I guess that could be worse. These have been fairly vanilla, I'm surprised that it, I haven't found anything weirder yet, so I'm gonna go on to a, another website that's more like community written. To get into some darkness. <laughs> oh sweet Jesus. No, 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 no. I can't do this. I'm gonna do it. Would Dan Howell date you? Wow, this is gonna make a lot of reaching assumptions about my personality and what I like. This is from Mia from Neverland. Well, thank you. Even if I disagree. What the f 113,000 people have taken this quiz? I don't know what to say. That's like more people than are probably gonna thumb up this video. Whatever, let's do it. Hey guys, this is gonna be like another role-playing quiz. There's others. Oh, so this is like imagining you're role-playing on a date with me. Christ. All right, here he comes, Dan. Hey, babe. Oh. <laughs> ah! In what universe would I say, hey, babe? Then what would my reaction to that be? Stab. OMFG, it's Dan. He's so perf. Dan, can I kidnap you and take you home, please? You can s sleep in my bed with me, wink face. I'm calling the police. I'm actually calling the police right now. Hello, Dan. Nice meeting you. If anyone said either of those things, it would be the fastest restraining order ever filed. I'm just gonna keep pull- <sighs> Then Dan says, time for questions. Because, you know, every good date starts with some, an interrogation. Do you like llamas? <laughs> Okay, to be fair, this was written in 2013. Some of this was still fresh. What do I say back? Of course, they're awesome. Llama drama. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it through this video. So, do you know where my birthday is? This roleplay Dan sounds like a dick. Do you know where my birthday is? As if I'm presuming I'm gonna get gifts. Who doesn't know? I love you like so much. Get in my car now. We can I'm just gonna stop reading these options. They're gonna make me just have nightmares. Dad, well, it was nice talking to you. Wanna hang out sometime? What is that? Is that the date? I give you a quiz about myself and then say leave. This is a shit date. Dan would so date you. Cool. Dan Sest is on the cards, guys. That's a Tumblr tag I'm not gonna search for. Well, I'm gonna have to take some really hard drugs to forget doing that. Um, okay, one more. Uh, this is one that Phil sent me. He said that he did it in his, so I should do this one too. It's by Sophie. Which fan body part are you? Honestly, I'm learning so much about you as an audience. Hey guys, so you're either here because you're part of the fandom or you're completely lost. God help those poor souls who end up on this page that have no idea who we are. God help all of you, to be honest. And me, we all need Jesus. Only the select few can be Phil's Globella. Is that a challenge? Uh, let's see. In order to discover this, I must first ask a question if you are brave to ask, what's your favorite color? I'm scared. Black like my soul. Boom. So what's your favorite type of music? MCR forever. Single tear rolls down Chica's intro to Welcome to the Black Parade plays. I mean, 14 year old Dan will always be a part of my heart deep inside. I know this is a horrific question, Try me, I've been through a lot today. But if you had to choose, would you pick Dan or Phil? I mean, what what happens here? If I pick Dan, does Phil die? If I pick Phil, do I cease to exist? I would refuse to choose. There we go, that's the slack answer that I guess 90% of people did. Which is your favorite Dan video? Hello, internet. 
I'm gonna go with internet support group because I, you know, I still make those to this day and I feel like it's quite reflective of me. And of these videos, which is your favorite Phil one? Oh shit, here we go. Dan's in a trash can is about to be revealed. Why I was a weird kid. They're just so damn relatable, I'm sure you agree. And finally, how much do you love Dan and Phil? This is a very weird experience for me. OMFG, you literally cannot comprehend how much seriously fangirl for life. If I cringe anymore, I think my neck will just snap off and a fountain of blood will just erupt into the camera. My life would suck without them. I mean, I, I guess it, it would. My life just wouldn't exist at all. Who da fuck are they? I mean, sometimes I ponder who are Dan and Phil. I have cow whiskers tattooed on my face. Thank God we haven't, no one do that, please. 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 I'm gonna go with my life would suck without them. I think that's very valid. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I got Phil's Glabella! Oh yeah, you're that sexy bit of skin between Phil's eyebrows. I'm so uncomfortable right now. I'm quite curious what the other results for this one are. Um, I'm not sure I want to know, but let's just see. <clears throat> Okay, dance hair. So you went through an awkward emo phase at one point and TBH is still not 100% out of it. I mean, you're dragging me, but it's all true. Dan's nose, okay, with the whiskers there, naturally pessimistic, but that's okay. Exact, that's the message I try to spread in these videos. This is getting too much, I need to get out to be honest. Um... My fucking crotch, I, use, I, I can't, I'm sorry, I, can, <laughs> I can't do this anymore. I'm, go, I'm, I'm at that point. But I've been at so many times on this channel where I'm laughing, but I think I'm on the verge of tears. This video is a mistake. I'm never listening to your recommendations ever again. And honestly, I blame Phil completely. Oh, whatever. Let's read it. Right. You are the party animal who loves to have a bit of fun. You've had plenty of embarrassing moments, which you're happy to share for the sake of making people laugh. That's what's happening right now. Your life is a roller coaster. I mean, what is this? Is that like the up and downs of my crotch thrusting into something? I mean, what what are they trying to say here? Well, I am declaring that the end of this little roller coaster. Okay, uh. let's let's reflect on this. Um, for real, don't take me the wrong way. I do love and appreciate every single one of these, no matter what the quizzes are. The fact that anyone out there thinks I'm interesting enough on any level to make a quiz about me is a true compliment. I appreciate you. Mostly. Um, I'm going to go and have a long and hard... <laughs> can't say that after the start of this video with that joke I made. Think about myself and my place in the world and with any luck, I, I will see you again. If you want to see if I ever come back, then ring the bell to get notifications by clicking that little symbol. And also I've started posting little photos and texts on this new community tab, which is fun. So that's now an extra good thing to do. You can click subscribe or over here to check out the videos that are still ongoing where I do live Q&A hangouts on my side channel. So you can see my crisis unfold in real time. And yeah, pray for me. Goodbye. <laughs>